twin sun is a relatively new planet on the outskirts of a remote galaxy. Its rotational plane has stabilized between two suns. There is a huge mountain range running along its equator that divides the planet in half. Each hemisphere is warmed by a single sun. The northern hemisphere, with its orange sky, is warmer than the southern hemisphere. Except for a polar region, the planet's climate is clement. The formation of life forms on the planet was thus favorable. Four species developed over the course of the centuries. The spheros, the rabbi bunnies, the quetches, and the grobos. They all lived in harmony until a tyrant named Dr. Funfrock reared his ugly head. Ever since Funfrock's rise to power, the population has been living under a reign of terror. Funfrock set up a police state where suspicion is omnipresent. He is all-powerful and controls the people with an iron fist. He has at his disposal two high-tech weapons that ensure his power, cloning and teleportation. He can clone any of the species at will and subsequently recruit these clones into his ranks. He can then deploy these clones instantly through a network of telepods that are dispersed over the entire planet. A few years ago, under the guise of protecting the population, Dr. Funfrock herded the planet's habitants into the southern hemisphere. The repression is harsh. Every day brings more and more arrests, and the people slowly begin to lose hope. In an effort to keep their spirits up, the people sometimes evoke an ancient legend along with the name of a goddess, Sendel. The mentioning of the legend, or Sendel, has since been forbidden by Dr. Funfrock. Meanwhile, a young quetch named Twinson has been having strange dreams. Stop squirming, prisoner Twinson. A prisoner has escaped. Sound the alarm. How's it going? You're being held here because you're a troublemaker. An informant told us that you claim to have prophetic dreams. Calm down. We're going to dissect... I... I mean, take care of you. just rediscovered your ID card. You just rediscovered your holo map. You can use it by going through your inventory.
Good day, fellow nurse. How's it going? I just have to wait for the truck to move into place. I've just escaped from the asylum. They think that I am a troublemaker 
because of the strange dreams I have. The ones where Sandel is calling me. I spoke to you about them on several occasions. I think it's time to make use of what you hid in the house. You've just rediscovered your magic ball. Try using it on the clones. You've just earned the first level of magic by finding the tunic left for you by your ancestors. You will be able to store up magic with it.
I'm looking for a young girl. She's being escorted by two Grobel clones. I haven't seen them. Sorry. My son and I fixed the ventilation flap in your chimney. We'll put up a fence later. It's odd that it is so far away from your house. According to my son, who is an architect, there are a lot of strange things about your house. You know, don't worry about putting a fence up around the chimney. I've thought about it, and I prefer to keep it as it is. I believe that you can read all the posters. All you have to do is move in front of one and use the action command while in normal mode. I can't really help you out. I'm looking for a young girl. She's being escorted by two Grobel clones. I know where they went, and I'll help you if you buy me a drink. Ask the waiter about it. I would like to buy a drink for the Grobo upstairs. <laughs> Very good, sir. But that will cost you ten cashes per drink. It's okay. Let's go. I'm looking for a young girl. She's being escorted by two Grobel clones. I saw them at the port a little while ago. They were leaving for another island. Yep. It's strange, because prisoners usually stay at the Citadel. Twinson, what are you doing here? I heard you were arrested only yesterday. They let me out early for good behavior. Impossible. Nobody gets out of the Citadel alive. Just found a bottle of syrup. I'm looking for a young girl. She's being escorted by two Grobel clones. I didn't 
see them. Try at the tavern, you never know. Did you know that the telepods are dangerous for all species? Only the clones can use them. cannot seem to arrange on the four crosses painted on the ground. I would gladly give a ferry ticket to anyone who could help me out of this mess. Crates are arranged correctly this time, thank you. And please accept this ferry ticket as a token of my gratitude. You have a ferry ticket. Welcome aboard! You have picked a wonderful day for traveling! The weather is beautiful!
Good day. I'm looking for a friend. She's escorted by two Grobo clones. We don't trust people easily here. Prove that you don't work for Fun Fork. Clobber a clone. for a friend. She's escorted by two Grobo clones. Didn't see anything, but if you have any problems, you should talk to the astronomer who is under house arrest up above the old berg. Good day. I'm looking for a friend. She's escorted by two Grobo clones. I didn't see her, but I think that I can trust you now. Follow me. I know how to get to the astronomer's home. My cousin is a locksmith. He will open the unguarded door for you. Follow me. If you want to see my cousin, go in front of the sink and wash your hands. <laughs> Good day. I'm looking for a friend. 
She's escorted by two Grobo clones. I didn't see her. I can help you get rid of the Super Gro. Follow me, but wait until he moves away from the steps before going by. I am Bob Vortex, astronomer under house arrest. What are you doing in town, apart from beating up clones? <clears throat> Good day. I'm looking for a friend. She's escorted by two Grobo clones. This young girl must be someone important if that tyrant Funfrock is holding her outside of Citadel Island. Something funny is going on with this forbidding of any talk about the legend. This must be some kind of weakness in his power. Find out what is behind this legend. It's your only hope of seeing your friend again. If you need to leave the island, I know a friend who can help you at Port Beluga. Check your hollow map. Tell him that I sent you, and be discreet in your quest. As I live and breathe, you will never see me drink any tap water in this city, mate. And all you have to do is drink some of it to understand why. Good day. This talk about the legend is strange, don't you think? I don't know her, but go see one bull over at the bazaar. And be careful. Normally, it is forbidden to talk about that. As I live and breathe. Welcome, dear customer. I don't have any more cherry-flavored syrup, but there is a pharmacy open on Citadel Island. <laughs> Move in front of the item that interests you and use the action command. Good day. This talk about the legend is strange, don't you think? Sorry, my dear customer, but this is a bazaar here, not a library.
good day. This talk about the legend is strange, don't you think? Sorry, I have never heard anything about that. Good day. This talk about the legend. Sorry. Good day. This talk about the legend is strange, don't you think? Sorry, I don't know what you're talking about. According to the book I have, there is a clear water lake in the Hamalagi Mountains, somewhere to the northwest of Principal Island. Did you know that the Hamalai Range is impossible to cross? It marks the border with the Northern Hemisphere, the one that Dr. Funfork cleared out. The sun is too hot for us over there, the temperature is unbearable, and the changes in climate cause the development of mutant monsters. And despite the fact that the good doctor spared us from all that, there are still rebels out there who want to overthrow throw him. It's shameful. Good day. This talk about the legend is strange, don't you think? I found this page ripped out of a book. It says, pull the middle lever once, then pull the right lever once. This must be the answer to some kind of puzzle. Good day. This talk about the legend is strange, don't you think? Did you know that Dr. Funfrock installed busts of his effigy to protect us? The ones that don't have a pedestal are placed on ancient seals. Since these symbols were indestructible, at least the busts hide them now. Good day. This talk about the legend is strange, don't you think? I can guide you through the censored publications department. There is one book that talks about the legend. I could show it to you, but first, I would like you to change the taste of the tap water here in the city. It is the only type of water that I am allowed to drink, and it is really disgusting. Good day. This talk about the legend is strange, don't you think? I'd like to help you, but I really don't know much, except about the movies. Uh, good luck. <laughs> I'm a huge Star Wars fan. The saga sequel should be released soon, so I already reserved my seat in the movie theater.
No more gas. 